Tunisia has firmly rejected an EU proposal to establish camps for African migrants on its soil. Every year, thousands of people cross the Mediterranean in search of a better life in Europe. However, Tunisian politicians and activists say the phenomenon will not stop if refugee camps are set up in Tunisia, and it will have a negative impact on the North African state. Belgian Secretary for Asylum Policy and Migration Theo Franken has urged Tunisia to accept the EU's proposal to set up migrant camps on its soil. He went even further to say it would be financially worthwhile for Tunisia. But the North African country has outright rejected the project. The position of the parliament and state is clear. We will not accept any migrant camps on Tunisian soil. The Belgian minister's offer is unacceptable. We will not change our position, even if Tunisia is granted financial aid. We're talking about the lives and future of human beings. Uh, Tunisia is already dealing with its own economic challenges, and analysts say the country is not in a position to host migrants on a large scale. Imposing a European project onto Tunisia is unfeasible. The country is already dealing with high unemployment rates and an ailing economy. It can accept migrants temporarily. But any long-term plans will escalate social tensions and the country will plunge into chaos. Analysts say the European Union has failed to stop the wave of people crossing the Mediterranean to reach its shores and is looking to other countries for a quick-fix solution. Europe can no longer deal with the migrant crisis. Brussels and Rome are looking for alternative solutions. Tunisia can help manage illegal migration by limiting the number of Africans who leave its shores. But Tunisia cannot play the role of migration police in northern Africa. When Italian Interior Minister Matteo Salvini visited Tunis last month, the challenge of illegal migration was raised. Then too, Tunisian authorities rejected any proposals to host migrant centers. According to the International Organization for Migration, tens of thousands of African migrants, at least 4,000 of them Tunisian, have arrived in Europe illegally since the beginning of the year. Activists assert that the politicization of migration has fostered the rise of radical discourse in Europe. Adam Shabashi, CGTN, Tunis.